So anyway, this is going to be a video on about what not to paint with. Um, yeah, I'm new painting Lexan, and um, by no means I'm not disappointed at all. I redone my broad gen too. I <clears throat> recently stripped the paint on this, and if you ask me, this just looked like a you done boxed a brand new RTR at all the pills, and it was shiny and nice. You know, um, I kind of, I still want to think it's a diamond in the rough. I'm going to have to pull it back and um, take a minute and strip it down. I didn't install the light kit. I'm going to, of course, I'm going to have to hold off on it. But what I want you to look at is, this is a hard hit too. Not, not the little scratches, not what we're looking at. Um, I just want to do this for... Maybe somebody else does the same thing I do. And I just want to share it. Um, yeah. That's clear. You can't... You, If you get it just right. That's a hard hit, too. I mean, a tumble. If you can't tell, too, this... This is a pretty good incline. All this is straight up and down a hill. Um, so anyway, what's it's just a couple little one, little ding right there. That's a pretty good in, impact. No, no, it has to be a pretty good little deal. It's, paint's coming loose. I painted the interior with the satin. Um, no problems. I've not had any problems. It's not. You'll be good with satin paints. I'm sure of it, or I wouldn't say it, because I've painted my Gen 2 with it, and that's why I have it out here. Um, I put enough fires on it. It's cracked right here. But you can see there's no, no, I don't, I'm, no blemishes. And you can tell that satin's uh, a lot different. And it's this right here, in case you're wondering. So that's what I did my interior. Uh, you're good to go. I'm, I'm almost for certain with this. Uh, what you're not good to go with is what I'm going to get to right now. So this is hold it up. This has been holding up good for me. Like I said, it's been... That's to no re no repair. Um, if you want to, like, hit the bell, that'll be a samurai coming up. I don't know when. Uh, but I'm going to... Not completely retire it. I, I want to keep it one piece. Just run it here and there. And another thing. Uh, let's see. Yeah. That's all I painted it with. Rust-Oleum. It says for plastic. Bonds plastic. So bonds to plastics. Uh. Anyway, I'm not disappointed. Like I said, I'm not. This little thing is a rock goat. I tell you, it's like a billy goat. It's a little top heavy. Uh, it's not that bad once you learn how to drive it. Uh, and I started out with a little shorter wheelbase, and uh, Gen 2 is a little top heavy anyway. So this just out here because I'm going to rock crawl for a minute. And uh, I just wanted to share this with you um, just because the light gets. It's gonna come. This is gonna go. I'm on, I'm still gonna do some videos, some crawling videos. But in the meantime, I'm gonna finish the head, and uh, like I said I'm gonna finish up. How long? It's about four minutes. But yeah, I think we'll plug her up.
Tuck the mirrors in. Yeah. So I don't want it to go in too long. My girls, they left the back door open. And uh, that's it. This thing is pretty neat. It'll go.